March Madness. NHL. Time to make a bracket. Let's go. I don't pay attention to college basketball. Ooh. 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 The NHL review. This season review is editing. Anyways. Time to make my freaking bracket. Who do I think is going to get win? Why do I think they're going to win? Am I a little bit of bias in this bracket? Uh, yeah, of course I'm going to be freaking biased to what I want to see. Duh. Anyways. So. Brightness. Engage. Okay. What do I see happening in the playoffs? First and foremost, I definitely think Calgary can beat Colorado. However, I think Colorado does have more firepower than Calgary. Well, not that they have more firepower. I just think Goudreau and Monaghan are outweighed by McKinnon and Rantanen. However, I could be wrong about that. You know what? No, I'm going to give the benefit of the doubt to Calgary. I think Calgary wins this round. Although, this is just going to be a tight series. It's going to be a tight series, I think. Uh, Josie's on a vacation far away versus Vegas. On one hand, I don't want to sleep on Vegas, but San Jose went all in. I'm going to say that San Jose is only going to win because they're going to play their freaking hearts out. Uh, I want Dallas to win. I need them to win. I need that first round pick. Sorry. Uh, St. Louis versus Winnipeg. Don't sleep on the Blues this year. Learn that lesson. Learn. That le- We're going to make a couple brackets. Uh, Tampa versus Columbus. I got to give them out to Tampa Bay. Not that I'm sleeping on Columbus. I just, I need Tampa Bay to win. Uh, this is, this is the bias bracket. Again, just saying, this is the bias bracket. Toronto versus Boston. Oof. Oof. It's a tough one. I'll give the nod to Boston just for now. Uh, Caps versus Carolina. Um, I don't think Caps lose to Carolina. I just don't see it happening. I think the Islanders beat Pittsburgh, though. I do think the Islanders beat Pittsburgh. I think that's a fair guess. I don't know. Islanders get home ice advantage at the Nassau Coliseum. I don't know. Pittsburgh's really good, but something about the Islanders just just weirdly just going to beat them. Moving on, uh, San Jose versus Calgary. I'm giving the nod to San Jose. Dallas versus St. Louis. I need Dallas to win. This is the bias bracket, at least for the Rangers draft pick purposes. Um, after that, Caps Islanders. I got you under my skin. Uh, I don't think the Islanders can beat the Capitals. I don't think they could do that much. Uh, Boston versus Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay definitely. Tampa Bay definitely beats Washington. And then San Jose goes to the Cup. San Jose versus Tampa Bay. I got Tampa Bay winning it all. 69. Just saying. Just saying. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, Calgary over Colorado in how many games? Five. This is a seven-game series if I've ever seen one. Dallas over Nashville... Like a six-game series. St. Louis over Winnipeg. If St. Louis was going to beat Winnipeg, they'd probably, it'd probably be a seven-game series. Columbus could push it, but I don't know. I'm not sleeping on Tampa. Boston over Toronto. Seven games. Five games. If Pittsburgh completely collapses, it'll, it'll be a, f- a four-game sweeper. I'll, I'll call it a six-game set. Okay. Submit my bracket. Now, let's create a real one. Oh, now I'm going to create a real one. I'm going to create one that I, um, uh, oh, okay. I'm creating the bracket, I guess. Yeah. Now I'm going to create a real one. Like one that I'm actually going to put a lot of thought into before I uh, go ahead and post it. Despite my uh, internal biases. So I, you know what? The more I think about it, the more I do want to give Calgary the nod over Colorado. So I'm going to stick with that Calgary pick. Now, um, don't snooze on Vegas. I think Vegas is going to beat San Jose. As much as I want San Jose to win, I don't think they're going to, I don't think they're going to beat them. Uh, I don't see Nashville losing to Dallas. Uh, I do see St. Louis beating Winnipeg though. I definitely see that. Uh, yeah, Tampa Bay, no, no, not a doubt in my mind. Um, realistically, I don't think Toronto can beat Boston. I think Boston having Patrice Bergeron, Bergeron's the most underrated player in that series. Not that Bergeron's an underrated player by any means, 
But, you know, when you think of Toronto versus Boston, you're only thinking about scorers. You're thinking about Pasternak. You're thinking about Matthews, Tavares, and Marner, and maybe Marshawn. But <coughs> I think Patrice Bergeron is the type of player that could steal a series. Because he's just that freaking good. I've, I, I'm giving the nod to Boston. Uh, Washington, Carolina, I got to give the nod to Washington. And I, I still think the Islanders are going to beat the Penguins. I definitely stand by that pick. Now, Vegas, Calgary... Calgary is going to beat Vegas. I don't think Vegas can get past Calgary. Um, speaking of, I definitely think Nashville is going to beat St. Louis. Um, actually, no. I think St. Louis is going to beat Nashville because I don't think Nashville has a good enough... I don't know. I don't think they had a good enough season. I don't think they did. For some reason, I just don't see Nashville going very far. However, the more I think about it... No, I don't... I don't St. Louis is too hot right now. Uh, Boston versus Tampa Bay. I don't see Tampa Bay losing. Um, Washington versus the Islanders. For some reason, I can see the Islanders beating Washington. For some reason, I can see it. I'm going to say the Islanders run out of steam. But I, I would not be surprised if the Islanders made it to the Eastern Conference Finals. I would not be surprised. I don't know. It's not, it, and it's not, it's not a matter of their team being so skillful. It, the Islanders are a weird team this year where they just, they just, everything's clicking and working. Do not sleep on Barry Trotz. Um, now, between Calgary and St. Louis, I think Calgary makes it to the Stanley Cups. And I think we get a rematch from 2004. I think you see a Calgary Tampa Bay Stanley Cup final. That's, that's what I think you see. Oof. Although, this is the only pick I'm thinking about right now. You know, I'm going to say San Jose beats Vegas. I don't want to sleep on Vegas, but... Nah, San Jose's got way too good of a team right now. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how Vegas would beat them. Uh, but I do think Calgary would end up beating San Jose. Ah, I changed my mind. I'm starting to change my mind a little bit here. I'm starting to think. Hmm. San Jose's too deep. They would beat Calgary. I think it would be a San Jose Tampa Bay Stanley Cup final. And that would be a really high scoring Stanley Cup final. I think Tampa Bay gets the nod. If there's an average five goals a game, 35. Yeah. I'll I'll say 41, which is almost six goals a game, which is a lot. No, I'll go 37. Yeah. Now, Calgary over Colorado. I'm going to give Calgary the nod in five. That's a, that's a six-game set. It's a, it's a sweep. Um, Seven-game set. Five games, seven game, five game. I'm going to say, I'm going to say a six game set. And that's my bracket. That's how I think the playoffs are going to look. So just do a quick looker. This is what I think is going to, this is how I think it's going to play out. This is my best prediction. <coughs> I don't know why, but this is just for some reason how I'm thinking. Best case scenario, um, Winnipeg gets bounced in the first round. Dallas loses in the Western Conference Finals and Lightning win the Cup. That way the Rangers have maximized the value of their um, four first-round picks. Anyways, that's just me. Um, all right. Thank you guys for watching. Comment down below, what does your brackets look like? Are they similar to mine? Are they different from mine? Let me know. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.